we can kind of tell that we're gonna like this place. Look at the old Corvair van down in there. It's got an excavating thing. Wow, this place little is so station, cool. Little gas station, little Texaco station. Pretty cool. Look at that. This is so cool. It is. It's a little, it's like, look at the water. And then look at the little uh, bulldozer. Yep. Look at a little rock shed thing. Look, they got a rope swing going up for the old steam shovel. Wow. Oh, cool. This dude's got like some artsy, artsy. Oh, look at the six by six. Yeah. Oh! You guys have gas corridors? <laughs> this is awesome. It's beautiful. Oh man, what a beast. <laughs> oh, look at the tires though. I think that's about the size tires I need for Boomer, honey. 58. <laughs> Dane, do you know anything about the history of the truck? Because I'd like to get that. Zero. We kind of got All right. it. Yeah. No, it was How long have you guys had it? That's what I need like to know. Like 12 years. It okay. was, okay, so it was sitting on a four-wheel drive international harvester okay. running gear. Someone was making a four-wheel drive out yeah, of it. Yeah, and it okay. had a 455 in the motor, and it was just, it was all cobbled together. All right. And Well, I mean, everything was welded. I mean, all the linkage was just welded together. So okay. We got rid of that, and that, that's what's left of it. All right, got gotcha. you. Anyway, not a good story. <laughs> you got fishes in there? Yeah. Yeah, there's all kinds. It is a 1955. Five? Okay. Yeah, and the only way you can know. tell the dip, so the 55 and 56 both have this front grill the only difference that you can tell is in 56 they made this bend in a little bit because it was impossible to get to the hood latch when you stuck there's another grill that goes right here okay. wraps around this you couldn't get in between there and uh get that these need to go in the truck this stuff and i'm just gonna be honest with you that right there and these right here and that are super scarce and super hard to get a hold of cool and a gmc big window cab of course so this truck had the deluxe trim on it and uh they had the deluxe gauges the deluxe he's like the encyclopedia controls. of these uh, trucks <laughs> this truck was originally uh, uh hydromatic and the way you can tell that it's that big hole in the floor okay there are some tin plates that go over that a regular truck just has a small cut out there for the steering column okay. but at the factory they hooked up all the hydromatic linkage to the column so they needed a big hole to drop that down the wasps uh -oh. did not come with it from the factory those were added later by the guy those with you <laughs> <laughs> those go with you yeah we'll lose them on the way home i'll roll the windows down perfect <laughs> Oh uh, look at it so used to dramatic was that was a little rare, right? He, yeah. He used to have a hood bird, Ricky. A, what? <laughs> he used to have a hood bird. Oh. <laughs> But yeah, so the hydromatic was that was a little rare, right? Yeah, automatic transmission, yeah. And it was a what? He used to have a hood bird. Oh you guys don't know where that is, do you? I don't I don't think so. Oh, Unobtainium. Oh, really? Oh, that's what the that is. The shadow of the unobtainium. Oh, like an okay. I've got one. Well, hi. I've got one. <laughs> they wow. only made two thousand of them. Wow. For for all of the nineteen fifty five through nineteen fifty seven GMC trucks, they had one hood burn, and, and and I always keep one. But sometimes the guy has to pay some bills, so right. if I come across another one, I keep the better of the two and offer the other one up. But um, it was, yeah, it was never on there. I never I even noticed that. I would have noticed that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, I mean, with the patina, 
Oh, well, <laughs> well, it doesn't have patina once they start spray painting it yeah. the way I see it. Um, this fender is not off a V8 truck. No. Because of the emblem? Yeah, there's no hole for, well, there's no, somebody must have filled it over because even a, this is a Chevy fender. I don't know. We'll investigate that later, but the stuff that I wanted is here, so we're all good on that. Inner fenders are uncut. Got the hood latch panel over there. Um, and is that a GMC tailgate? I don't know. I mean, I'm not asking you to get stung. We'll find out. Anyways, from what I see, we're good. And uh, I can pay you and we can start getting loaded. This truck also had uh, this brace right here wasn't on all of them. It's a cowl reinforcement brace. And there, when you have this... Hi guy, I know, but you're wet. Uh, GMC tailgate. Okay. Cool, that's good. Bonus. Uh, this brace it had special rods that came down here and tied into the frame. Not all of them had that. Looks like something happened here, huh? Or did they just weld it? Uh, they cracked it? right there because that was the reason for putting that. In. There oh, okay. were a lot of vibrations. And it just cracks. Anyways, it's got the uh, stainless trim around the windshield and it's still got three of the original clips which are hard to find all of the original wiper assembly stuff chrome vent window assemblies yeah it's good phones this this could be built into a truck where's your ball where's your ball glad you saved it <laughs> all right i guess we'll get to work huh where's your ball go go where's your ball Love. go get it Start loading your Go get your ball. Then we'll get the cab over there. Go find it. Yes, no? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now I'm going to put a new battery in this genie and then I'll set it up on a tripod so we can get it. All righty then. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> heavy that is. Alright. we turn it around? Um, but it'd be tough to pick it we, up. I don't think it, I think you could pick it up if we turn it around. Um, and we'd be able to get it, the weight a lot more further forward. That way the stuff's hanging off the back instead of... Yeah, and I can just run a strap over all that. Yeah, let's turn it around. I just don't, I don't want to get it wagging on me when I go home.
show over here. Oh, still got the one hood. Down the back, one down the back of the pickup. Yeah, I'm gonna put the small stuff in. Yes, please. Oh, short bed, spare tire rack. That's pretty, that's pretty cool, right? Yes, it is. hood rocket homie got a hood rocket to boot isn't that awesome honey yeah, you know I just put on Facebook I'm like what oh my god scores one of 2000 oh, never made Rick is not gonna shut up <laughs> hours on the road can you blame him <laughs> It's awesome. Thank you, Lord, right? What a blessing this whole weekend's been, right? Yeah. Right. Praise the Lord. Thanks for joining us, folks.
That is cool. So what is, can you tell us exactly what this is first? Well, it's a 1961 Corvair uh, van. Mm -hmm. And uh, we called them compact campers back in those days. And uh, I, now, I started to build more RVs mm -hmm. and I had a company called Chinook, building Chinook RVs. You owned Chinook? Yeah. Holy the Chinook cow. the ones that were on the Toyotas? Yeah, but they also made all kinds of other stuff. Yeah, yeah, big variety wow. of things. Cool. Motor and what's your name? Gary Lucart. Gary Lucart, I'm Rick Maylander, Classic Truck Rescue. Nice yeah. to meet you. Oh, yeah, that's, that's what we do. Yeah. Um, so can you show us the kind of things that you did to them to, to modify them? We built the top. Yeah, I see that. <laughs> that's so awning. cool. Uh, two people. That's all right. I'm gonna back it up a little bit. What? I'm gonna back it up. Oh, uh, get out of the water? Yeah. Yeah. Back up a little bit. <laughs> the Corvair 95, 61 Corvair 95. Actually, Are those the original hubcaps? Yeah, everything is original on this vehicle. Yeah. I, I built it. Uh, at that particular time, I told you that we built uh, uh, these units for about a year, to a year and a half, two years, and then we started building other vans, even Ford and GMC mm -hmm. and all that kind of stuff. And then eventually I got in, into building bigger units mm -hmm. and all that kind of stuff. Wow. Yeah. But this is the one I started in. That is so cool! Oh my gosh! Oh wow! Oh my gosh! That's right, so cute! A little bit nerdy. I haven't seen it since our last road trip. Up on the doors. And Look at that! So you guys still go on trips with it? Oh yeah. How cool! Yeah, I've done a, I've done a lot of trips. That's why it's so dirty. Because the last time I took it, I took it down uh, the Oregon coast. I bet that How was sweet. fun. Wait, so, look at that. Do you just get mobbed when you're driving it down the road? <laughs> Not as much as you'd expect. Really? Yeah. I actually have more people honking me for driving slow than oh, honking hey, me for hey. a cool rig. No, you got to cut some slack to the old guys. Yeah. How neat. Here, Ricky. Oh, yeah. Oh, let me use the GoPro so I can get some. Look at this. Look at this. The colors on this. Look at Corvair orange. That's Corvair orange? Yeah. One of a kind color. You found the color for that, Grandpa. Yeah. You know the upholstery. I redid the upholstery and I went to a guy that, yeah, and uh, this might have happened to you guys when you're restoring something. I, I went into the guy's place and I had a sample of the, the original one that we had in that. And uh, he had a, a roll of that same color. Oh yes, uh, guys do that with the Cameo pickups. Yeah. They had a special upholstery on the seat and they seek it. They try to find that. In this area right here, this thing, we used to build uh, what a countertop and I had a rollers on it. I rolled oh, that out. would come out. Uh, yeah, and uh, this one just happened to be, I found this in Palm Springs about uh, 25 years ago. Yeah. Looking for, uh, one of these uh, was amazing. I was able to find one totally yeah. original. Uh, with all the special stuff that you made for it. We had yeah. 13 of them, right? Yeah. He had, he had 13 with originals. The top and stuff. Wow. That's so yeah. cool. And my, uh, we, Dane, Dane slept on that front seat. Oh yeah, hey, what, uh, I'll raise it up here in a minute. You got a big kick out of that. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Look at this. Oh my gosh. So cool. It's just beautiful. Holy cow. How clean. Well, you're hogging up all my camera. Yeah, all I got is and get you oh, well, all I that. got is your butt. I thought you liked filming that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Wow. Hey, Rick, this upholstery yeah. is uh, awesome. Uh, stand back and watch it. Uh, get a video of it. Yeah. It's going up. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, oh it's got sunroofs in it and top vents and an awning. How neat. Wow. Did you have to redo that fabric in there? Oh, Did you yeah. have to replace that when you restored it? Wow, it's like new. Oh, wow, that really opens it up. Yeah, uh, hop up in Holy there. Holy cow. Yeah, hop up in there. Get, hey, Shorty, forward. get up in there. That's made just for you. Uh -huh. hey, boy, no, it's, it's tall. Get, climb in there. Wow. Yeah, climb up in there. It's really big once you're in Whoa. It's neat. In the bedroom. Oh, yeah. Does here, that uh, turn into a bed? Yeah, no, there's, there's two, uh, two cots, bottom. both sides. Yeah. Oh, wow. So, uh, these actually fold out just like a normal like a kind of like a military cot would oh cool yeah there's one wow. on each side you wouldn't want to get up there drunk and <laughs> oh, <laughs> fall we're, out we're yeah yeah look at that this is so cool <laughs> I had three kids in my family. Yeah. yeah. At that time and, and uh, Mary and I would sleep on the bottom Dane would sleep up, our youngest one to sleep up in the front seat, and then we put the set of twins, boy girl, in the top. So, so we, did you build your first one out of necessity? <laughs> well, I built a, I built one for my dad uh -huh. to go uh, fishing and all that kind of stuff, and he's the one that got me in the bed. Ah, that was a good thing. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, so. These are some of the things that we built it for. I copied that particular top with Dormobile in, in England. Yeah. They were, they were building tops like that. What were they putting them on? I ripped them off, you know. <laughs> American own. Ingenuity. <laughs> oh yeah, here you guys would yeah, yeah, oh, love this. This tells the whole history of, of everything. Oh. So that, so that's 1963 and that's him right there. That's you. That's the man. Wow. Right there. And then actually my uh, my dad is this little baby right oh, here. Oh, wow. The car. <laughs> that's Dane? Yeah, that's Dane. <laughs> cool. He even got the palm swing. Oh, he's got pictures oh. of when he first got it. That's when he first, first got it. That's the guy right there. When you first found this, I bet you were like when Dane yeah. pulled that hood rocket out from under that seat. That's me and that's right here behind us. And I paid $250. Oh, wow. <laughs> I mean, that was an absolute... Yeah, that was a good day. I had it down by the airport <laughs> mm -hmm. in a storage yacht. You know, just sitting out. And that was a, a good thing of her. You know, a loss at her to have these things available in... Uh, Palm Springs. Is, oh, yeah. yeah. In that climate, yeah. That's, that's me and that's my brother right here behind us. Wow. Is this you right here? Yep. Wow, how neat. Thank you for sharing this with us. Yeah. You don't see yeah. stuff like this very often. I don't think I've ever seen I've one never of these. Seen one. Uh, yeah, never. How many are left? Pretty, do you think? Uh, I like a, I like flat yeah. bottom. Have you seen others? It's just amazing. Yeah. It's wider. Yeah, it's like a, yeah, it's like a full like circle thing. Yeah. Wow, that's so yeah, of course, beautiful. Very cool. Of very cool. I gave it to my uh, noble. Yeah. Yeah, I want to get a pair of yeah. for this. So, for this. No. Uh, well, not even for workout. Grandson? I have, I have no. free or, My son, my free grandson. Free. Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah my, my mom loves her grandchildren yeah. more than me, too. <laughs> so, I understand. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Have you guys ever heard of the Palm Springs and Washington sign? Huh? Never this heard of that? Palm Springs in Washington? If you pass yeah. Yakima, you'll see this sign. Look at this. Oh, yeah, there you go. Sean Shepard, you can look at this video and weep. This thing is so cool. Have you guys ever heard of the Palm Springs of Washington sign? Uh-uh. Never heard of that. Palm Springs in Washington. When you go past Yakima, you'll see this sign. When you're driving out of town. Oh, the Palm Springs of Washington. Welcome to Yakima. Yeah. Okay. That's it. that's his sign. Yeah, he, it's so it's right there by the big Coca-Cola building that's there. 
Wow. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's a that sign is better. so awesome. They actually, I, I, I think they have one now in Palm Springs. I it heard says, it, I welcome heard. to Palm Springs, the Yakima so, yeah. of California. So you guys, you're kind of famous. Really? Yeah, he is. Yeah, that guy is. is. <laughs> He's done big yeah. things. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, thank you so much for sharing that with yeah, us. We love stuff like this, and now we'll be able to share it with the whole world. Mm -hmm. And like I said, this is located in Idaho. So if you're ever in <laughs> Idaho, stop by and look at it. You know, uh, the last vehicle I made on a... Uh, for a special uh, display was in in Louisville, Kentucky for the RV industry in 2005. Yeah. And uh, we built a Chummer motorhome, and I still have it. Oh, wow. wow. Yeah. That's and, so cool. And it is an absolutely amazing. It, it'll blow you away just like this one. This is just, it. it's just eye candy. It just pops. When we came around that corner, it was the first thing I yeah. said, oh my God, <laughs> look at over there. <laughs> you actually need to be in like Chevy GM Hall of Fame, really. Yeah, this. Uh, yeah, you should. I agree. That's so I built, cool. I, I built one. Uh, in fact, the guys were calling me all the time and sending me stuff in the, uh, on the computer. Yeah, I built a uh, Chevy Calais, uh, Chalet which is uh, a camper built on a... Uh, Blazer? Blazer chassis. Blazer. I've seen them. They so didn't he, make... For, that he, was you too? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. And then he did the, he did the Toyota the pickup ones. Chalet. Yeah. yeah. The Toyota the Chinooks, the little yeah. dualies. Yeah, that was, that, was, yeah. that was him too. Yeah. 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 Wow. Wow. Oh, yeah. He did well. Yeah. <laughs> he did some yeah. things. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to go up there and... Uh, awesome. <laughs> you want to see that truck my dad was talking about real quick? I do, oh, yes. Yeah. yeah.